Good evening, everybody. Hope everyone is doing well. Just checking over the last few things, making sure that everything's in place for us to get going. Okay, so we're not going to wait for the full 2 minutes and 40 seconds to count down. I accidentally reset the time on that, so <laughs> my apologies on that. Oh yeah, so welcome everybody to the stream. I hope you're all having a lovely day and or evening, depending on where you're from. So before we climb into it, there's just a couple of things I want to mention. Uh, for those of you that are not aware, all of my past live streams do get posted to my YouTube channel. So if you wouldn't mind going over there, subscribing, turning on those notifications so you can catch up on your past live streams that you might have missed. Also, I am trying to get to 50 followers, so any kind of love and support that I can get from people watching would be highly appreciated. Share it with your friends, share it with your family, share it on your social media, wherever you can to help spread the word, to help draw some attention, this way would be truly, truly appreciated. So, tonight we are going to be carrying on with our Path of Exile build. Now, the reality of it is this is probably going to be the last part for the Power Siphon. At this point, it simply just becomes a case of trying to chase that elusive um trying to complete off the build we're trying to level up but there's nothing really in the sense of like acts or anything that over here becomes very repetitive which is what i don't want to do so what i'm doing over here is opening up my path of building making sure i've got everything i need so rather than this becoming too repetitive and us focusing on one build for too much longer, this is probably going to be the last part for the Power Siphon. After that, we are probably going to have a look at something like a Seismic Charge. I saw it looks like quite a bit of fun. The damage is a bit delayed, but we'll cover that when we actually move on to that build. Also, for those of you that are curious, pretty soon we will have a fully flushed out Discord so that the community can get together, can talk, can chat, can communicate, can share should post whatever you want to um in a place offline when we're not streaming so once that is up and running as well i'll be plugging that as well so that you guys can go show some love and go join the family over there i am trying to build a community at the same time i am trying to get feedback feedback on how i can make it better feedback as to how we can grow this community feedback as to how i can improve by listening to you guys that's the only way i'm going to improve so that's the ultimate goal Okay, so let's not mess around any further. Let's actually switch over back to the main game. And let's take it from there. So I actually want to reload this. So I just changed the name of my most recent follower back to JJ1997. The reason for that is I had one individual came in last night, follow me, and literally not even two seconds later, unfollow me. So just removing their name from there. No recognition for that person. So, JJ, you are still my most recent follower. Thank you very much for that, man. I do appreciate the love. And here is this damn vault thing. Let's see if... Hey, right, we got a map. Claim... Claimed. 
Now, I'm definitely not paying for the battle pass. That's for damn sure. I'm just going to collect the stuff that I uh, keep. Thank you very much. I'm just going to keep the shit that we get for free. It's not spectacular in any form or way. But it's free shit. And we all like free shit. I don't think I need to be doing that. Is the sound coming through on the game correctly? Okay, it is it's just very quiet. <laughs> okay, so we're back over here. I think tonight we're just going to grab some maps. We're just going to run a couple of maps, and that's basically about it. This is a tier 2 map, I don't really want to run a tier 2, but you know what? I've only got really one tier left on this. I've already completed it. And as far as I know, I have... Oh, I've got one left. The tier 6 is nothing special, but it's something. Actually, it's in the meantime, let's see if we can't run one of these maps. Uh, tier 8, tier 8... These are all tier 8s by the look of it. There's one tier 9. 72%. Magic monsters avoid ailments. Damage is fire and unique bosses are possessed. This map Let's run this map, see how it goes. Just making sure the area is clear before we start that event. Grab the scrolls and the portal scrolls because I am running low on them, so I need them. So, grab that one for the first one, we'll grab that for the second, on grab that for the third. Danger. Uh, fuck. I think I fucked it. Oh, well. And yeah, we'll just put you there. And that's because I got cocky, and I was like, nah, this person's not going to do enough damage. And I very much paid the price for it. Now, I do think there's going to be a very realistic possibility that once this build is done, before I start the next one, there's probably going to be a nice little gap. I'm not 100% sure yet. I think there's going to be a decent gap before I start the next build. Just because I don't want to just focus on one game. I would like to obviously spread my wings into other games. Start building a player base that... A community that's like diverse in what we play, what we watch, what we do. That's the goal, at least. Unfortunately, though, if my player base or my viewer base only wants to watch me play Path of Exile, it kind of limits me. And obviously, at the end of the day, I want to make sure that the people watching are the people that are happy. But I mean, the player base at the moment, if I'm being realistic, we've got 10 followers, and of those 10 followers, I've only ever got two people in stream. So, <laughs> not like I'm going to be upsetting too many people if I do go that route. But I am sticking to the notion that I believe that. This is a 
consistency game and I just need to focus on doing my streams every single night, putting in the work and the followers and the the viewers, that'll all come. So there's some blue monsters. Let's start this one. Crystallized life force. Nothing really spectacular that I'm getting from this. Okay, these are things that I didn't have prior previously. Previously. Oh my god, I can't English tonight. I don't know how that happened. My elemental resistance is on. Oh, wait, it was maybe the fire on the floor. Because my elemental resistance on fire is absolutely shit. It's down to 30%, so. Eh, that does make sense. Okay, so that's that good done. Necromancer circlet. Interesting. I don't think I've had that before. Got the arena map. Uh, let's dump the shield. Let's grab this and let's identify it. So it's a uh, Kaitu's Apex. Elemental resistances, elemental damage, increased experience gain, maximum mana, and maximum strength. It's not horrible. I've seen worse. I don't think there's anything else over here that I want. So we'll just grab the, the scrolls. Grab the crafting recipe. Leech, which is nice. And then we'll just run off in the top left. See if there's anything out there. Highly doubt it. I need more I don't even have space to put that. Uh, I don't need that skill. I'm not going to use channeling support, so... And I think that's as good a place as any for me to bounce out of here. I look everything I've got first. Well Nothing done. really in here that I want to keep. Anything I want to keep is that. I'm not going to sell the maps. Don't be stupid. That stays. That stays. That goes. That goes. That goes. I don't want it either. Everything else stays. 
and the rest of it's other currency or maps. So, let's see what I can get rid of. It can be moved. And onto this page for the maps. Uh, onto this page for these things. And onto this page for that. And then that and that. Because I don't know where those go. I don't have a new box yet. 40 crafting. I'm never going to need enough for that, and I don't focus on that element of it enough to want to spec into that direction. Okay, I've got a tier 7 map. Tier 6, sorry. Oh, I've got one tier 9 map. Let's take this one. Onto the park we go, and hopefully this is going to make our lives easier. Just need a moment, creatures. Danger. An intellect. That was that's Maven. What exactly did I take? I think that's just the thing for the boss fight. Make sure I'm not missing anything with this. So allows you to pursue the searing exact you just have on the map device, okay. Nothing I can do with that in here. I have to wait until I return back to uh, back to the hideout. Yep, okay, so now I know what killed me last time. It's the fire. My... Oh, because I've only got one health. I am an absolute, absolute idiot. I wondered why last time I died so quickly to the um, fire, thinking that because my resistance was so low, that's why I died so quickly. But forgetting that I've got 3,800 um, energy shield. That's it. After that, I've got one health. If I take any hits after that, that's death. I completely, for some unknown reason, completely forgot that I only had one health. I kept wondering why once my shield disappears, I basically die instantly. Because I do all die instantly. Done, Maven. I guess I've actually got two things for the. Well, that's gonna help my shit a lot. Let's play some Tetris. What tier is that? That's a tier 8 map. Eh, not great, not good, not shit. It's okay. We can live with that. Yeah, 
think that's what I get out of here. Everything here is completed, everything is done, we can move on. I think really I want to keep it more so. Okay, that's done and okay, so that was just for that. I'm worried about that right now. That personal map device. Oh, I suppose I have to mix it with something else. Set off the ship that I do have. Hail. Not that. I need to actually put that away before I make the mistake of accidentally selling it because my ass ain't paying attention. Uh, let's dump this with the rest of the uniques that I want to keep. Wherever the hell that pad tab is, there it is. Everything else you can go into damnation for, like if. So we'll use those two together. That's going to get sold. So map device, that and that. I can't do that, but I can do that. So let's activate that. Let's see how this goes. Maven's Crucible. I'm guessing that was the extent of the entire fight. Oh no, please don't. That was unbearable. That was too difficult. I cannot do that again. I'm getting cocky because I said that shit last time and my ass got fucked up. So ignore everything I just said. And now we just go back to the hideout. Sell off this shit again. Let's go there, 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 there. They give me better shit, but it's still nothing spectacular. Survive. Oh, I want that. That can go away. I've got no scrolls. And it's okay, too. Barely explore the rest of this little thing. I've already found the stairs. I just I need to do the rest of it. Okay, we've got a uh, six socket at least. That's some that's some uh, currency. It'd be better if it was a six link, but a six socket I can live with. Got some more divination cards. Uh, one of eight corrupted. So they're all dead. That was Gruesome. quick. How once a turncoat, always a turncoat. Okay, let's speak to Pepe Le Pew over here. Unveil what don't I have? Increase mind throwing speed. 90% lightning and chaos. Something hits it's the mind throwing speed. Why not? Weapon penetrate elemental resistances. Confirm. Why not? I'll take the Chris. 
I'm not gonna waste time with a bow. Okay, it's good for now. Let's go down to the next level. I need to be doing something quick. Give me one moment. I need to do this. There. And yeah, there we go. And make this full screen. Okay, there we go. So I just wanted to make sure that this is up and open so that if something does happen, I don't miss it. And he said, I wrote comments and he's losing stories on Twitch. I don't need that right now. Okay, two stuttering claws, flask, stagger, creeds, wand. Okay, we finally got this. Now we can get this last one, which is 10% increase, one damage, power charge. I'm currently doing about 264,000 on that. If I apply that, that goes to 294. So I've got about a 30,000 increase just of that alone. I want to test the theory, so please ignore it if it does pop up. All right, so that does work. Um, thank you very much. Uh, that was not actually a follow. That was a test for me on my side. I just wanted to make sure the layout and everything looks good. This pass up and build really does end up killing him up. Let's bring this up. Because it's all I actually want to see. Come on, make this smaller. Make this over there. All I'm actually in interested in seeing is that. On to the next set of stairs. Yeah, they're all dead. Execute. I'll take that and the map. I'll execute you as well. Then I'll take that and that. And Hillock, I'll bargain with. Finishing touch and that. I'll take this as well. Why not? I'm going to speak to Jun. Unveil items. Uh, critical strike multiplier. 
chance to deal double damage while focused. Let's just do that. Why not? That's not something that can be unveiled. Physical damage, 10% chance to poison on hit. We'll take that. That's not one. That's not one. I think it was the necklace, maybe? No. Belt, yes. Uh, fire and chaos, I'd rather go... No, cold and chaos. Okay, they're all exactly the same. It's whether one fire, lightning, or chaos, cold. I'll take lightning just simply because it's a bigger percentage. And then I think the ring was another one. Yep, that was the last one. And then that one, I can only have one option. Okay. So that seems like it's a good enough place for me. I don't know if I've beaten the boss yet. Probably haven't. Probably just fucking around over here. There's an arena. Keep pressing the wrong button because my ass ain't paying attention. Quicken. See, wasn't too difficult. Uh, I want that. Another necromancer circlet, really? I just picked up one of these. I don't have the thing to be able to identify it, so take the diamond ring. Um, drop this. Okay, apparently they were okay with that, and I'll take the gloves. I think that's as good a place as any for me to leave this area. Okay, we've done that now. Now we can go to the top. All possible ignores going to ops are available when six gateways are allocated. We go through that. And now we do the big outer circle. Once the big outer circle is done, we then start moving our way up towards these. How many are there? Five? Ten? Yeah, these ten nodes over here. That's how we are going to identify which elements of the uh, end game we want to focus on. But I highly doubt we're going to get there for this, because like I said, this is probably going to be the last string for Power Siphon. Hero. I think that's about as good as I'm going to get. Just want to hold on to the Necromancer. Okay. Survive. Stash. Put this away. Literally two of them right next to each other. Put away the shit I just got. And then we come back and check the qualities of what I just got. Now that can go with that. Okay, so first things first, I need some teleports. And I need some of those. That's fine for now. And then what I want to check. Oh, yeah. Uh, grab one of those. There. So, 22, 28, uh, 5 increase, 5 increase, 10 increase, 10 increase, 11 increase. Okay, so this one is better. Energy shield, it's got a lower energy shield, but its strength and maximum mana is more, as well as it increased elemental damages. This one, the energy shield is a whopping 2 more, but there's a whole percent less in other categories, so no. Here's my question, what do one of these things actually go for? Are they worth selling? Like, just a vendor? Not really. But fuck it, I've got Farewell. two. That was not worth it in any form or way, and especially when I start putting the shit in the wrong places. Here we go. 
Okay, well, at least that map's done. Uh, no, don't go back inside there. Thank you. Now let's go back in. I could have picked up other shit and came out with it. I am being so stupid right now. Let's see if we do this. Oh, it works. It's the follower goal has started properly this time. Check some more maps. Let's run a seven. I've done a seven. I've done those. I've done those. I've done that. I've done that. Done that one. I've not done that one. It's a tier three, so it's not exactly a spectacular, but I just want to run maps that I haven't run. Hopefully I get adjacents. And then on this I have not done the bonus objective, so we'll do it again. Completed both. Done everything in there. Done everything in there. So these are the three maps that we need to run. Nothing spectacular, nothing wow. I'm not even gonna bother spending the alchemies on them. I'd rather spend the alterations on them. Target is not magic. Oh I need to make this right wrong one. Physical damage is lightning. That's fine. I don't have the currency to be able to fuck around with more expensive shit, so let's take the tier one map and let's just throw a powerful beasts in there. And a three percent increase in quantity of light. Actually, you know what? Let's take a let's take a rogue exiles. Let's make this interesting. Why not? Tier one map, so just need a moment. Mana flask, mana flask, life flask, dagger. So that's one. I think we need to find. I don't know how many more there are. I think there's three of those in total that we're looking for. Yep, there's the next one. Let's start that so long. And we just keep spamming, and then that was done as well. Nice. Plans for us. Okay, let's start playing some Tetris over here. Tier one map. I'm just gonna leave these ones at the bottom. I don't want to fuck with the ones that I've got on top ready that I know I want to run next. So I think we're gonna move those to there. That to there. 
We're good on that for now. What is with all the life flasks? Like, seriously? Uh, that's 2,200, 15 or 45. That's 2,400, 2,200, two okay, so it's actually worse than what I currently got. For some reason, I thought it was more. I mean, basic maths is an issue. So bottom half done. Start moving up north. I suppose I can grab the ring, the amulet. I can grab the wand as well. It's a random spot for it. Then I'll grab the helmet. I'll start dropping things like the helmet once I pick up better shit. If I pick up better shit. And there, there's another flask. Oh, why the hell are we picking up stuff? Hey, if you'd want. No fucking ways. This guy's vigil. 37 imp increased spell damage. 34. No physical. 11 and attack speed. This one has got 18 attack speed. Okay, so the attack speed is less on this one. 28% increased. 27. 396. 386. Okay, so mine's actually better on that. Attacks of weapons have 113 increase. 102. And that's 5. And that's 20. So this is... Mm, I potentially want to use that. But I do not know if I've got the currency to be able to switch out the sockets on that. I just realized the only viewer that was me. Okay, so what do I want from here? So I've got 4,287. So, fire resistance, cold resistance, stun threshold. I'll take the rare. I will definitely take the scarab. I'll take the jeweler's orbs. I'll take the orbs of regret. There's our currency, so I want them over here. Thank you very much. You know what? Fuck it, something to sell. I'll take that. Nothing really else that I want inside here. It's not worth it. That's done. Let's start with a circle. I don't think I fought the boss again. Okay, so now we're going to start moving to the top left of the map. And that should be all that's left. And then this map should be done. Got the chills, I got the ammo, got the coral ring. That's perfect. Did I fuck it up? Was there another? S oh. Didn't think there was going to be another one. I fucked it, but it's okay. It's okay. Let's grab this. Let's loop around. Oh, what is the boots that I got? Um, identify. So I currently get a 30% increase movement speed off of my boots. This gives me a 20% increase movement speed. Okay. So not as good as the increase movement speed, but it is still good.
See, once again, even though I did that, there wasn't exactly anything that I was missing that I needed and or wanted. So, if anything, I'm just going to take that and just take that and then just take those three. There's nothing else that I want in here. I think after this, this map will officially be done. Yep, we're done. Nowhere else to go. Okay, now I'm going to sell off all this shit. Get some currency. Not going to sell that. We'll sell that. Not going to sell that. That's all we want to sell. Farewell. Everything else is currency. So currency gets placed where currency always goes. That's a rear ring. That's that. That's that. That's that. That can get sold. Maps, you and you can disappear. And then you can go there. Uh, fertile, fertile, fertile. Don't know how I got to fertile, but fertile, fertile capitalist. Um, uh, scarabs, scarabs go in there. Okay, now for the big thing. So, to change this to a two socket, I would need one of those. Okay, so it already has that many sockets. So, if I do at least two green sockets, it's going to cost me 25 alteration. Okay. It's going to cost me 25 of those. I can't remember how much I've got of those. 83. First things first. Let's grab this. Let's use this one because I want to see if this makes up the difference. It's a weapon. I want to compare these two next to each other. So, 37. A 34. No physical, no physical. No more attack speed. So it's got less attack speed, but it's got more critical strike. It's got more accuracy rating. Less elemental damage, but it's got more... No. So critical strike is 8.96, 8.89, both 20 attack per second. This is 1.77. This is 1.67. Hey, what's up, man? How you doing? No, I'm actually just... I just wanted to look at raw numbers first. So, 275. 294. Big difference. But I'd love to know what's making that big percentage difference. Because the only thing that I can see that's truly making that staggering distance, because the one that I picked up has got more percentage spell damage... But the overall attacks with this weapon have a 102% increase to elemental damage. The one you gave me is 113. Everything else, however, is more. Percentage spell damage, increased um, critical strike chance. The attack speed is a little bit less, though. Now, the old one is better. And it definitely is better. But at least it's nice to know that I found one of them. I just needed to compare. Can't shoot at you because you're not an enemy. I'm trying. <laughs> what is it that you're shooting over there? What skill is that?
Brains you. Okay. So, Maestro, I think I set some kind of record last night. Okay. Yeah, I'm almost 100% certain that I set some kind of record last night. So, while I was busy uh, streaming last night, uh, not that long, shortly after you left, I saw that, hey, I got an 11th follower. By the time I finished my sentence, I saw the number drop again back down to 10. Just to afterwards go and check that I had somebody follow me for exactly 11 seconds. <laughs> Uh, what's this? Reduce recovery rate. I'm going to use this. It's only got two charges though. Never mind. It's not bad though. Never mind. I know. I don't know why. Oh, I learned the hard way. Like, if you want to and the stream is done and you go back to how the stream started. I couldn't for the life of me. For some reason, the fact that I've only got one health completely slipped my mind. And I couldn't understand because the ground was uh, scorched. So I had pockets of fire everywhere. Now, obviously, because my res is down to like 30%, I was taking quite a bit of damage from the fire on the ground. So my energy shield was running out relatively fast. And I couldn't understand why the moment my energy shield ran out, I died instantly. I was like, what's happening to my health? <sighs> like an absolute fucking idiot. I forgot that. Hey, dumbass. You don't actually have any health. That's been my day so far. So I was already master. Hope your day went better than mine. I think I'll sell anyone from here. Have I got space for anything? No. Does, does this go anywhere? No, it doesn't go anywhere. Okay. 
gonna sell that. Not gonna. S you know me, like the hoarder. Just got home from work and I'm absolutely knackered. Trust me, brother. I know you're feeling like with me. It's a little bit different. Like I don't. Farewell. I don't think I'm tired. I think I'm just like irritated. I don't know what I am right now. Let's put it that way. Uh, let me guess. I'm an illustration and artwork. Dude, this is really starting to get insane. I've reached 80 followers on uh, Twitter. Yes, I know it's not phenomenal. It's not amazing. But that's in like two days i went from like 40 up to 80. every single one of them that has followed me has been artists every single one so i actually sent out a tweet later on to um, earlier on today and it was kind of like aimed at them because some of them they don't exactly read it but they press the like button on some of the stuff that i post so the, I specifically asked it. I'm like, um, oh, fuck. Oh, let me actually get the one that I sent. Uh, that was the mage blood. Um, I have a question. Do all the, in brackets, graphic artists that follow you ever support your content or do they just follow you hoping for business? It had 94 views and four likes and two people commented back. And then literally one of them was a person saying, I have a suggestion for you about your Twitch channel. <laughs> it's like, really? <laughs> you in inevitably like answered my question. <laughs> Fuck sakes. Uh, oh, well. I don't know where this goes. I don't know if I've even got a space for this. I highly doubt I've got a space for that. I think that shit has just been going in here for now. But yeah, my man, trust me, I feel you. Like, I was really contemplating whether I should stream tonight. Because I don't know if it's just a mixture of... Because obviously, I still work a 9-to-5 job. So, it's up at what half past seven in the morning uh out the house by like quarter to eight so i can be at work at like half past eight to start work at nine and then obviously work until five o'clock in the afternoon get home at about let's say half past five then it's gym make dinner spend time with the wife and all that shit and then at about half past nine half past nine quarter to ten i then start streaming and i start streaming until about 12 one o'clock in the morning like last night we only stopped streaming at about one o'clock and i've been doing that day in and day out for the last 31 days so i don't know if it's that or if it's just like the the lack of growth that there has been or if it's just uh, i i don't know what it is but like tonight i'm just like Heh. you know that, 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 that burnout feeling where it's just like ah, i'm done with this shit. i'm gonna take a nap until next week and then come back to all of it again <laughs> Here's some nice currency.
is it supposed to? Supposed to cover those two. That one. That one. Kill those. That one. Alright, well. I should also mention this might unearth more sleep. You can take him. Fire resistance, fuck it, we'll do that and replace that because my fire resistance sucks ass, so we'll just put that in the first slot. Why not? Some random creature just standing there staring at me. Being all weird. So that was pointless. Okay. Huh, yes. Right, uh, we've got part of the building. So we finally finished off this. Finally finished off that. Now we need to start making our way over to the far side. Oh, it's the big fucking snail thing. I don't know what to being called this creature. It looks like a big beetle. Snail. I don't know how I got this snail. He's dead. Grab the wand, grab the gauntlets, why not? That identify the ring. It is a dream fragment. Cold resistance, mana regeneration, more cold resistance, cannot be chilled and cannot be frozen. That's a fuck ton of cold resistance. What? That is 50%. Yeah. No, 60%. Sorry. Yeah, that's 60% cold resistance off of one ring. Not bad. And we're done, yeah. And then just one more to go. Sell off all this shit. Hail. Everything except the ring. Farewell. No idea where that went. Uh, I want to check one thing. Why are you checking, right? Okay, let's see. Okay, so let's do that. Okay, so currently my DPS is 307,000 for Power Siphon with my wand. With your wand, that's 379,000. That's a 75,000 increase in damage. 307 to 379. Uh, item has sockets placed into trade anyway. Yes. No. Cancel, right? Uh, 
I, I just want to make sure I haven't. No, no, you take yours. Uh, I just want to make sure. Sorry. Um, must I take out your your gems before I trade it back to you, or can I just drag it as is and place it in there? Okay, cool. Alright, let me just do this, just so I can cancel it, just so I can... Yeah, let me just do that, then I'll give you yours back. Just need a moment to attach my bearings. Just giving you all of yours back. That's actually pretty cool, though. Oh, there's a 70,000 increase in damage. It did look like a very, very good wand. Sorry, can you just link the wand to me again, please? I did not look at any of the stats. The only thing I had to look at was the um the output and what it did to the power siphon. I didn't actually even have a look to see what it did, what the stats were. Yeah, yeah, I can imagine. So, 10 to 226 damage, elemental damage, 29 to 53 physical, critical strike, 8.75. Quality does not increase physical damage, 1% increase attack speed per 8 quality. It's 10 to 226 lightning damage, 93% increase spell damage, fuck me. Attacks with this weapon penetrate 15% elemental resistances. Uh, can have up to 3 crafted modifiers, 12 increased attack speed, and 25 increased critical strike. Damn. Um, the attack speed is just kind of shitty, ain't it? Or is the attack speed on it, like, ridiculously quick? I can't remember if this game represents the higher number as worse or the higher number as better. It would make sense that there is eight attacks per second and not that it is one. And it goes up to 13. Oh, okay. And then I need to run just this map. Nothing special, nothing fancy. I fucking hate this map as a general rule when it comes to the goddamn um, ascendancy trials. Now I'm being forced to do a run in this map. Oh, yeah, well, I'm trapped. I physically can't go anyway. <laughs> Okay, once again, I think uh, if it was to craft the wand with the attack speed not being bench crafted, we'd be in a whole other ballpark in Divines. That is true. Once again, I think there's a possibility that I've got a tower shield, but I've made that joke enough times, I don't think it's funny anymore. <laughs> I just love seeing this happen. Enemy gives you not one drop but all the drops and that takes up way too many spots for the cost for the currency I'm going to make from it so I'm not even going to bother picking up any of them I'd rather pick up the mask mask only takes up 4 slots
you be victorious twice in a row? Oh. I've actually got the proof that I could, I've actually beaten a trial master. <laughs> I actually survived all um, 10 waves last night with JJ on the, on the stream. Uh, let's start. Okay. I like this one. Monsters gain a 5% increased attack cost and movement speed per second they are alive, up to 50%. They don't survive long enough to really gain much. Um, take that. Spell damage and gain 5% What? Oh, we'll just go for more choking. The encounter area will be much smaller. Monsters cannot be slowed or stunned. That's fine. Don't exactly want them to be slowed or stunned, they just want them to die. Uh, monsters hit with 10% of current energy shield. No. Monster types will apply ruin with the special ability, fail on reaching 7 ruins. A very fast card that shows you. Eh, let's go well. Let's just go with uh, blistering cold. Vengeance is cold indeed. And let's go with the next one. Let's do residents. one oh, that's another blessing called one come on if I could press the fucking button one more time Okay, I've actually got the spots to actually be able to pick up everything for once. 
Ah, fuck, that's all shit. Uh, where was I going at this point? Further across. 294. Okay, so that doesn't actually do anything for damage. Okay, that's okay. Everything's gonna seem so calm now compared to what we just went through. I know this just loops back in, I just want to make sure there's nothing that I missed there. Oh, well, that was done. That was quick. Really, that was the boss fight? I just went through the fucking trial and... Then I get that there's my boss fight. <laughs> oh, fuck. Is there anything in here that I want to keep? What does Granite do? Increase duration. You know what? No, I'll keep that. I'll keep that onslaught. I'll keep that. I'll keep all of that shit. I'll just sell everything else. Don't know where that goes. Don't know where that goes. That goes over there. Don't know where that goes. Got no idea where those ones go. That's why for right now, I'll just dump them over here. Because I don't have a slot for them. Hero. Survive. No. You can go there. You can go fucking there somewhere. Cold resistance, armor, granite. No, fuck it. Don't know. Okay, so I think every single map that I've owned, I have done. Yeah, so I think at this point, it's just going to be repeats trying to get other maps. Done all of those. Completed all of those. Completed. Completed. Completed, completed, and completed. Oh, hold on. Hey, I've actually got a tier 10 map that I haven't done. Nice. Uh, increased accuracy, suppressed while this rotated. What? Do I turn off an aura? No. All still there. I've noticed sometimes the damage differs, like now it's back up to 307,000. Uh, get precision. Okay. I still don't think I'm running Grace, just by the way. I never think I actually went to go pick up Grace. Uh, no, I did not. So what will, what will be better, Grace or Precision? Well, let's have a look. So, Grace, fuck it, buy it, and then Precision, I'll take you. Okay, so if I take Grace and I'll put you over there, you know, maybe it kind of helps if I actually go back to somewhere, you know? I think I do. I do. She's right there. I don't know why I ran to the port. I honestly can't tell you why I ran to the port. And no, I don't have the mana reservation for Grace. Okay, Grace comes off. Precision goes on. No, I want and you. No, my damage is up to three hundred seven. What exactly does precision do again? That grants accuracy and critical strike chance. Eh, okay. Okay, 
And don't ask me why I ran all the way to the fort to go fetch it. Like I said, my brain ain't 100% here tonight. Surprised I haven't died like every 10 seconds since we started. And I'm just going to keep that active and go. Oh, now it's up to 277,000. Nice. No, that's bad. Wasn't it on 307? Or was it on 207? It was on 307, right? Can't remember. I'd really like to get auto DPS if I turn off my level 1 precision. Well, currently, if I've well, power siphon it currently sits at uh, 249. If I turn mine off, and eh, my damage stays the same. Need to give it time to actually level. side what's the vol please fuck it at something let's go this way first see what's in this direction Nice couple of cards, not bad. Don't want to take any bows, they take too much, too much space. It's handling a T10 map, no problem at all. nothing over there <laughs> true i'm just talking about where it's at right now because the build isn't finished and yeah just from where i am at right now i'm happy it's my lucky day is it is it really
decent Everett's horn. Okay, good for a fire build. Big ass sword. Rigwald's charge. I'm confused. Oh, gotta go straight now. What? Ramus. Oh, there's another way that way. I'm very confused as to where the hell I need to go. That was fun. Boots, 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 belt. Well, oh, boots are fine. Still, I'm taking. This belt, the Craven Secret, would in would increase your damage by six million. Then why the hell are um, have I got it? Why the hell aren't you using it? You're gonna find a bigger benefit from it than I am. Like a much bigger benefit from it than I am. But I mean, still, goddamn. Six million damage. I mean, fuck you, bro. That's a lot of damage. Oh, look. I got another follower on Twitter. Let's see. Who could it be? Transforming ideas into visual masterpieces where creativity meets strategy. Uh Eh, Apollo's a follow, I guess. I'd actually like to see one of them in here. Just once. Hail. Uh, sell that, sell that. Keep that, keep that. Sell, sell. Sell. Uh, that's it. I'll sing of you. These other ones are uniques. I'm going to hold on to the uniques. And then dump, 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 dump. And then everything else. Those are cards. Eliminations. That goes down to here. That gets packed away. That gets packed away. And then let's put away the rest of the currency. Do you busy research researching something new to run or to build or something? Or are you planning on doing any runs? Farming for sp something specific tonight? only thing you're planning is bed i oh mean i'm even at that point like because i ain't feeling 100 percent today i think i just tired from all the like the day job and then the streaming at night so, so much i think it's the mix of like tired and like not sure what the next steps are i also don't think i'm going to be doing a very long stream tonight <laughs> Conretti. <laughs> you haven't come to a Conretti conclusion. <laughs> it's 
So I don't know if I think maybe a, a, a way. It's, uh, um, you see, I can't even English tonight. I think maybe a way that my evening is going to be spent more productively is if I actually just go work on the Discord a bit, get that ready for everybody. So that there's uh, another place that we can try and fill up. I don't know. I think I need to do some brainstorming to be able to determine what the next steps are going to be. Definitely what the next steps are going to be. And then I need to figure out, but I don't know if this is where JJ is going to come into play, how to half and off link my uh, Discord with my Twitch and uh, my YouTube and my Twitter, for example, so that if I post on one, it automatically posts to Discord. I don't know if you can do that. I don't know if that's a feature. Hell, I can't even get it to that the moment I go live on Twitch, it automatically lets, sends out a... Um, tweet. Don't even know if that's possible. There's a couple of things I obviously want to try and get sorted out. And there's some things I want to research as to what hashtags, key phrases are things that draw in the most attention. Because I think I kind of fucked myself with the whole Twitter thing. I'm getting a lot of artists, but that's because a lot of the hashtags that I've been putting there is like new streamer and uh twitch uh live twitch streamer um uh community gamer that kind of stuff like that's the kind of like hashtags i've been using hoping that that's like a crowd that i obviously want to hit but i think what's also happening is that all the artists have got those hashtags flagged and basically anybody that posts within that they like ooh pounce potential client Okay. Well, I think that's what my plan is going to be for the rest of the evening. I think I'm going to deep dive into the Discord, try and get that sorted out, start setting up a couple of rules, start setting up the role, start sorting out the access and that. Then when JJ is available one day, I can sit and chat with him to see if we can't find out the details of that. So I think that's going to be me for the evening. Sorry, everybody, for a very, very short stream. It is an hour and 40 minutes, so not too short at least. Maestro, thank you very much for all the support, man. I appreciate you always being here. I appreciate you almost like clockwork joining the streams. Even after you've worked, it really does mean a lot. And it hasn't gone unnoticed and it won't go forgotten. I can promise you that. But thank you very much for joining the stream. Um, for those of you that are not aware, as I mentioned in the beginning, um, all of my past live streams do get posted onto my YouTube channel for you to enjoy at your own viewing pleasure at a later date if you could not make it to the live stream. Also, like I said, this is probably going to be the last stream for the Power Siphon build. Just because at this point, it's mostly just chasing the levels, but you're doing a lot of the same thing. So I highly doubt there's going to be another Power Siphon video. They might. I'll still figure that one out. But I do want to start branching into other games as well. And then also potentially look at start building something else like a Seismic Trap build, which our lovely master in chat is actually responsible for showing me how awesome it looks. But thank you very much to everybody showing some love and support. I appreciate it. If you can spread the word, if you can share it on your social media to help grow this little community, it would mean a lot. But I hope you have a lovely day and or evening further. Look after yourselves, be safe, and I'll see you next time. Until then, bye-bye.